So much of our planet is impenetrable dense forest and mountainous wilderness that has not been explored. Wherever there are these kind of conditions there are local stories of giant wild humanoid ape men. Even in the harsh frozen tundra of Scandinavia, Siberia, and of course the Himalayas. Even before the 20th century at a time when the panda was still a mythical animal to Westerners. Bushmen, local natives and foreign homesteaders told tales of mystical and sometimes frightening encounters. From the very beginning, shocking photographs and casts of footprints were the stock and trade of hunters. Occasionally their claims would be backed up by gruesome exhibits. In the 21st century, Bigfoot hunting is a serious business. Professional hunters often shoot a deer to use as a lure to draw the creatures out into the open. Low light, night vision and time-lapse cameras have yielded compelling evidence. Licensed Sasquatch hunters travel far and wide, chasing even the flimsiest of leaves. Long hours of waiting and watching. Sometimes rewarded with a glimpse of a shaggy bulk. Or even a fresh footprint. Where there's a chance of scientific discovery, some see an opportunity for profit. All too often the expedition team found their mission hijacked by unscrupulous poachers, who would almost certainly sell any finds to the highest bidder. With the priceless evidence disappearing into private hands, the mystery could remain unsolved for years to come. Suddenly someone stopped the 
shambling figure striding away in the distance. The pack tracks the creature as far as a waterfall that feeds a wide meandering river. While some gaze through camera viewfinders, others stare through telescopic gun sights. Before long, the inevitable happened. Expedition team members have found themselves powerless to prevent the senseless slaughter of such a beautiful creature. After the poachers had loaded their quarry into a crate and fled the scene, all that was left for the expedition team was to scour the area for hair, skin, and blood samples. Before long, team members began to notice the faint cries of a young animal. Following the route being taken by the captured Sasquatch, they soon come upon a clearing, where they find a baby creature that seemed to be calling for its mother. That night the eerie silence was broken, only by the blood-curdling growls of unknown monsters. When morning came, the team found their campfire dead, and the baby Sasquatch gone. Team leader Godfrey Goldblatt whispered Freeze. It's just a show of strength, a warning. In a way, a peace treaty. Don't pull that trigger, boy. Because you're so right. Just no more. Thank you. 